Let's do Biden. Uh, hit, hit the crazy town. <laughs> Everything <'Cause>, is. <laughs> because uh, I'm into G, I'm into the G5. I like I like to get fractional ownership in a G5. And it sounds like Biden was talking about G5. So let's uh, let's see what it is. Roll it. Hello, everyone. And uh, but today, not only been an affirmation of our shared history of sacrifice that binds the Republic, Korea, and North and the North, uh, excuse me, and uh, the United States together. Where the hell are we? Our alliance has long been the linchpin of peace, security, prosperity, and the region growing more prominent, and us being together. And I thank again the president for that agreement. Today, we made important progress on a range of issues. We spoke about the shared approach of the democratic, shared approach to the Democratic People's Republic, and we can scale up, glo- and so we can scale up global vaccine, vaccine supplies. This includes everything from strengthening our cybersecurity to deepening our cooperation to build out an open, secure G5 network. A 5G network, I should say. <laughs> I'm talking about the G5. It's another organization. Another organization. I'm thinking organization, Mr. President. Our people to people and cultural connections are only growing. And uh, K-pop fans are universal. Do you say corn pop? I can tell those who laugh know what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, anyway, I'll get back to that later. Anyway. Oh, yeah, sure. And what I'm convinced of is that we can now move, as I had did even before I was able to negotiate, well, I shouldn't, before the ceasefire was negotiated, that I made it clear that, and I'm prepared to put together and I'm going to attempt to put together a major package with uh, other nations who share our view to rebuild the homes and without re-engaging, without providing Hamas the opportunity to rebuild our weapon system, rebuild the, uh, the, the Gaza, uh, re, 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 rebuild Gaza. Well, I get to the next question, huh? <laughs> I'd like to ask the press a question. Uh, I have one question about North Korea and one question about Israel. We've changed this one question thing, haven't we? <laughs> what I never do is I never make a judgment what a man or woman is going to do or not do based on what they said. But what I would not do is I would not do what had been done in the recent past. I would not give him all that he's looking for is uh, national, international recognition as legitimate and, uh, and say and give them what allowed him to move in the direction of appearing to be more... Uh, how can I say it? More serious about what <laughs> it wasn't at all no serious. Idea. <laughs> Thank you. Can you say it? Look at the prime minister. What the hell we is this guy talking about? Over the remainder of 2021, we're we're going to be able to vaccinate every American. We have enough. We have enough vaccine to vaccinate every American. Period. Right now. And we're going to be able to do that by the midsummer. I don't believe, I never have believed, that there's a large percentage of Americans who will not take the vaccine. If you're not asking me a mean one like you usually do. <laughs> President Obama says that there is footage and uh, records of objects in the skies, these unidentified aerial phenomenon. And he says we don't know exactly what they are. What do you think that it is? I would ask him again. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Come on, boss. Let's go. <laughs> this guy doesn't, he's like, I didn't even ask any questions. What about me? Did he say, come on, boss, let's go? <laughs> <laughs> what? I, I would love to have um, 